South Africa defeated New Zealand 12-11 in Paris on Saturday in the final match of the tournament. There were some big names in attendance at the Stade de France in Paris on Saturday as South Africa took on New Zealand for the final matchup of the 2023 Rugby World Cup. Rita Ora, Jason Momoa and Novak Djokovic were among the fans in the stands as South Africa secured a narrow victory against the All Blacks, 12-11. Ora, 32, was also joined by her husband, Taika Waititi, a native New Zealander, as they sat in the row behind Momoa, 44, who was wearing a sweatshirt to show his support for the All Blacks. Djokovic, 36, was on the singer's other side, and the two were spotted chatting during the match. The tennis player, who is currently ranked as the number one in the world, is set to begin competing in the Paris Masters Tournament on Monday and was wearing a suit as he watched the action unfold in the rugby final. Roger Federer was also in attendance at Saturday's game along with his wife, Mirka, and their four children, twin daughters Myla and Charlene, 14, and twin sons Lenny and Leo, 9. In a cute moment, Mirka, 45, took a photo of her husband and their kids, all of whom were decked out in South African colors and Rugby World Cup caps as they watched the side they were supporting secure a victory. Also in attendance at the match was royal couple, Princess Charlene and Prince Albert. The Monaco Royals, who share twins Princess Gabriella and Prince Jacques, eight, were seen showing some rare PDA at the Stade de France. Princess Charlene, 45, grew up in South Africa and was photographed kissing and embracing her husband amid the country's victory against the All Blacks. Since the start of the tournament in September, there have been many famous and royal faces in attendance at various matchups throughout France. The British royal family has made several appearances to support England, who advanced through to the semi-final but were beaten by South Africa, 16-15. Kate Middleton was frequently in attendance at the Games as part of her royal role as patron of England's Rugby Football Union and Rugby Football League. After the quarter-final match, when England beat Fiji, the Princess of Wales, 41, stopped into the team's locker room to meet the players and congratulate them on the win. She shook hands with players in their dirt and grass-strained uniforms, some even standing without shoes in their socks during the visit. Kate even stood near a pair of muddy cleats on the locker room floor, as seen in photos shared on the rugby team on Instagram. Great to have our patron Her Royal Highness the Princess of Wales in attendance, the team captioned the shots. Prince William and Prince George also showed their support throughout the tournament, as the Prince of Wales is the longtime patron of the Welsh Rugby Union. He brought his 10-year-old son along for the quarter-final game between Wales and Argentina, and Kate reportedly said that George loved it so much, per hello. In a video shared on social media, the Princess of Wales joked about her son's attendance at the game with rugby legend Sir Bill Beaumont CBE. He took full advantage, she said of George's enjoyment on the pizza during the game, to which the world rugby chairman replied, he tucked into the pizza all right. Yes, I know, I did hear that, Princess Kate agreed.